So our day surgery at Health and Healthcare is a wonderful program. The advantage is that you get to spend the first night after surgery at home with your family. That's different to what we used to do, where we used to keep patients in hospital for anywhere between one to three nights. The advantage is that you get to stay home with your family, you get to sleep in your own bed, you get to eat your own food, and get taken care of by your family. So patients seem to really like that. The important thing to know is that the discharge criteria is exactly the same for our day surgery patients as it is for our patients who stay overnight. So we're not trying to cut any corners to get you out of hospital any earlier. We just find that it's safe, and effective and increases patient satisfaction. Before you're cleared from the hospital to be discharged, you have to be cleared by the surgical team, by the anesthesiology team, as well as by the physiotherapy team. So the same criteria as if you're staying overnight. We find the patients really enjoy this. We know that our day surgery program at Health and Healthcare is safe. We've seen no increase in emergency visits or readmission rates when comparing to patients who are staying overnight. To provide patients with an extra level of comfort, we've added a nursing visit in the patient's home or virtual the day after the surgery. Additionally, if patients need help 24 hours a day or seven days a week, there is a helpline that they can call to reach a nurse at any time of day. Finally, patients' main concern is how are they going to deal with the pain after surgery. We have a very extensive pain protocol that we've been developing with the work of our acute pain service team that really helps patients deal with the pain with four different types of pain medicine. Patients have found this very helpful and very manageable to deal with their pain at home. Typically, after surgery, patient's family will receive a communication from the surgeon. Usually this will involve indicating that the patient will spend between an hour and a half to two hours in the first level of recovery room. Next, they will be moved over to the day surgery area. After patients have arrived in the day surgery recovery area, and once the nurses are comfortable, family will receive communication from the nursing team indicating that the patient is ready for visitors. We typically tend to discharge the patients after total hip, total knee, and total shoulder replacement in the late afternoon or early evening. 